Welcome to the 57 Heavenly Beings Who Appeared to Joseph Smith video. Joseph Smith was visited by quite a few heavenly beings. I have tried to find every recorded visitation. I found 57 heavenly beings. Okay, first one is Abraham from the Old Testament. Read about it in Doctrine and Covenants 137.5, which will be referred to as DNC from here on out. Okay, and now we have Adam, and the Mormons also refer to him as Michael, DNC 137.5. Next one is Alvin Smith, that was Joseph Smith's older brother who died uh, before Joseph, DNC 137.5. Okay, next one is Elias, DNC 110.12. He and Elijah restored the sealing keys, the power and authority to bind in heaven all ordinances performed on earth. Okay, Elijah. He with Elias restored the sealing keys, as I mentioned in the previous slide. So it was Elias and Elijah. DNC 110, 13 through 16. Of course, God the Father appeared to Joseph Smith in the first vision. DNC 7620. Okay, we have James the Apostle from the New Testament. Uh, mentioned DNC 2712 as visiting Joseph Smith. Uh, Peter, James, and John restored the Melchizedek priesthood uh, to Joseph Smith and to the church. And Jesus Christ was one of the ones who appeared to Joseph Smith in the first vision, DNC 76, 20 through 24. Next person who visited Joseph Smith was John the Baptist. And he restored the Aaronic priesthood, DNC 13. Okay, John the Beloved, who was the apostle of the New Testament, uh, DNC 27:12, as mentioned, visiting Joseph Smith. Uh, he, along with Peter and James, restored the Melchizedek priesthood. Okay, we have Moroni, who was supposedly a prophet in ancient America, came to Joseph Smith to help him with the golden plates, uh, DNC 20, verse 6. Okay, Moses, which is mentioned in DNC 110.11, he restored the keys of the gathering of Israel to the Mormon church. Now we have Paul the Apostle from the New Testament. He visited Joseph Smith uh, according to the teachings of the prophet Joseph Smith in 1976 book. Okay, we have Peter the Apostle. DNC 27.12 supposedly visited Joseph Smith. Uh, Peter, James, and John restored the Melchizedek priesthood. And even Satan came for a visit with Joseph Smith, uh, according to DNC 128.20. We now get to the 12 apostles that were here in America. Nephi, son of Nephi, is the first one, according to John Taylor in the Journal of Discourses uh, 2194. Uh, Nephi, son of Nephi, visited Joseph Smith, along with all the other 12 apostles that were here in America. They all visited Joseph. Uh, Journal of Discourses will be referred to as J of D for the rest of the video. And we do not have very much artwork uh, with Christ and the 12 Nephite disciples. Here's one example. We may, may only have one or two others. Okay, another one of the Nephite apostles that appeared to Joseph Smith is Timothy. Uh, this according to John Taylor, Journal of Discourses 2194. And it's going to be the same reference for all of these Nephite apostles and some general artwork above of Christ. Uh, with his disciples. And we have Jonas, son of Timothy, one of the 12 Nephite disciples who appeared to Joseph, and some general artwork here. And another one was Mathoni. Another one who appeared was Mathoniha. And another Nephite disciple was Cuman, who appeared to Joseph Smith. And we have Kuman Anhai, who appeared to Joseph Smith, one of the 12 Nephite disciples. And we have Jeremiah. It's not the Old Testament prophet. This is one of the 12 Nephite disciples. Also, Shemnon. Okay, this is the other Jonas. There was two Jonas disciples. Um, this is the other one. And all 12 of these guys appeared to Joseph. And Zedekiah was another Nephite disciple that Joseph saw. And finally, Isaiah. Not the Isaiah of the Old Testament. This is one of the 12 Nephite disciples. Not sure if all 12 of them appeared to Joseph at the same time or if it was one by one. 
Another person who made a visit was Enoch, according to John Taylor, Journal of Discourses 2165. And the son of Abraham Isaac appeared to Joseph Smith, according to John Taylor in Journal of Discourses 2194. Jacob from the Old Testament also appeared, Journal of Discourses 21. Okay, we have the Mormon prophet in ancient America. His actual name is Mormon, and he was one of the record keepers on the Golden Plates. He appeared to Joseph Smith, according to John Taylor, in the Journal of Discourses 17374. And we have the ancient American prophet Nephi, uh, according to John Taylor, in the Journal of Discourses 21, uh, also appeared to Joseph Smith. And also Noah, who is sometimes called Gabriel in the Mormon Church, uh, also appeared to Joseph Smith, John Taylor, Journal of Discourses uh, 18, and then DNC 12821. And according to the diary of Oliver B. Huntington, Joseph Smith was visited by Eve, who was from the Garden of Eden, Adam and Eve. And we also have the 12 disciples in the Old World appearing to Joseph Smith, all 12 of them. We've already gone over Peter, James, and John. Uh, now we have Andrew, the apostle. John Taylor, Journal of Discourses 2194, and all these apostles have that same reference. Joseph also saw Philip, the apostle. And also Bartholomew. And he also saw Thomas. And Matthew the Apostle. And he saw the other James. There was two Jameses that were the 12 disciples of the Lord in the Old World, the Jewish disciples. Uh, this is the other James, but he also came to see Joseph. And the disciple Thaddeus, sometimes called Judas, also appeared. Also, Simon the Canaanite. And we have Judas Iscariot, one of the 12 disciples who betrayed Jesus. You can see him whispering in this picture. Uh, but Joseph Smith also saw him. Okay, and now we have Seth. He was the third son of Adam in the Old Testament. Also appeared, John Taylor, Journal of Discourses 21. And we also have Raphael, the archangel from the Old Testament, DNC 128.21. And we have Lehi, who came to the ancient American continent from Jerusalem, was also supposed to have appeared to Joseph Smith, according to Wilford Woodruff in the Journal of Discourses 16. And we have Alma, an ancient American prophet, appeared to Joseph, according to George Q. Cannon in the Journal of Discourses 13. And we have Enos from the Old Testament. Uh, according to Latter-day Saint belief, he was supposed to be a high priest, uh, DNC 10753. Also, Canaan or Canaan, DNC 10753. And we have Mahalalil, which appeared to Joseph, DNC 10753. And here you can see the genealogy uh, first generation starting with Adam, then Seth, Enos, Canaan, Mahalalil, Jared, Enoch, Methuselah, and Lamech, and Noah. And I think all of these uh, appeared to Joseph Smith, according to DNC. Then we have Jared of the Old Testament, also appeared, DNC 10753. And here, here you can see the generations from Adam down to Noah. Uh, most of these guys lived for over 900 years. And then we have Methuselah, DNC 10753. And again, according to John Taylor, Journal of Discourses 18, Abel appeared to Joseph. Also, Lamech appeared, Journal of Discourses 18. And then we have Joseph of Egypt, uh, son of Jacob, mentioned in the Old Testament, uh, visited Joseph Smith, and that's in DNC 2710. Okay, when Joseph Smith and some saints were walking through Illinois, they came across a skeleton, and Joseph Smith, in a vision, identified the skeleton as Zelf. So that was another person who appeared. The Ancient American Warrior, the Lamanite Zelf, Times and Seasons 6, 7, 8, 8. Okay, according to the 1833 Willard Chase affidavit, uh, when Joseph Smith was getting the golden plates out of like the stone box, there appeared in the bottom of the box a toad, which kind of jumped up and transformed into a man or a spirit. So we could also count that, I guess, as, as one account of an appearance to Joseph. And we have come to an end of this video. We have some accounts here listed on this page, if you can see them. The M there, that's the M, as in Mary, accounts are of the 
Book of Mormon golden plates. The ones that say F are of the first vision. Uh, this was one of, the, one of the lists that I used to compile this video. And I thank you for watching the 57 heavenly beings who appeared to Joseph Smith video.